is Red Green, and today I'm bringing you a tutorial uh, solely on the purpose of recording Discord with the Elgato software. So first thing you're going to want to do is open up a new tab and go to the Elgato website, um, and we'll see how the newest software, obviously. Uh, what you want to go is down to downloads, uh, click on the Elgato that you've got, I have the HD60 Pro. Then you're going to want to download the software just like that, it'll pop up, it'll come down, you're going to open it, it'll install the new software. Um, I already have it installed, obviously, uh, but yeah, that's what you're going to want to do first off. Uh, second, you're going to come here to your Elgato sound capture. Uh, there's going to be just no things, so you're going to press a little gear, it's going to be on off, you're going to change it to team chat. Um, I, it'll, it'll start at 100, I usually lower it a little bit, uh, I'll just reset the defaults so you can see everything. Uh, click on team chat. I usually turn this down a little bit, you can, uh, that's up to your discretion. I change this to none, and then you're going to want to make sure your headset is set to what you want it to be. Um, automatic usually works, but it might not be. Uh, second thing you're going to want to do, go to your live commentary, make sure it is what you want it to be, uh, whichever mic you want, I'm using my Yeti, so that's what I'm going to have to use. This, this box will be checked, you're going to want to uncheck that right there, uh, so it will not automatically reduce game sound, because that really throws off everything. Uh, your game audio, set that what you want it to be, uh, you, I think it'll start at 50, I'd turn it up a little bit, or maybe it'll start at 70, yeah, I think it'll start at 70, anyway, I'd turn it down to below my live contrary and my Elgato, but that doesn't really matter because they're going to be in separate channels that you can uh, configure afterwards. Well, the next thing you want to do is go to your Discord, um, for Discord, that's what most of my friends use, uh, you just want to click the user settings, go to voice. Uh, click on the output device and choose the Elgato sound capture speakers. In Skype, it's really similar. You're just going to want to go to call, audio settings. Um, after audio settings, you're going to click on your speakers and change them to the Elgato sound capture. Like I said, really simple. Uh, and yeah, that's basically it. Um, there's some more settings you're going to want. Uh, go to here, with little gear up at the top. You can go to uh, capture, make sure it's capturing where you want it to be. So the location is almost all these are the same spot. Go to sharing. These boxes are going to be checked. You're going to want to uncheck each and every one of these and check all of these. And then lastly, uh, click that little blue button to make sure your commentary is recording. And when it is, you'll see this thing moving. And when your friends are talking in Discord, you'll see this little bar moving. And then you're going to want to record. Uh, yada, yada, yada. Just talk a little bit. No. Uh, stop recording. And then you go over here to your editing segment, and you will have your file. Uh, trim it up a little bit. I say I don't want to cut, loosen that part. Whatever. You cut it, and you click the the um, MP4 render thing, and then it'll automatically open your folder with your file. This file is going to be your friends talking in Discord. This file is going to be yourself talking, and this file is going to be your game audio um, mixed in with the regular audio of the video. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Oh, one more thing. Um, obviously, there's three audio controllers right here. Uh, th this is going to be up because you don't have a microphone selected. Um, but the reason you're not selecting a microphone there is because you're going to have your microphone here so you can um, manage your own audio as well as your friend's voices. So this little slider, this changes how loud you are. You can see if I turn it up. Um, I think it's a little louder if I turn it down to where I usually set it, around 65. Then you're uh, a much more normal volume. This is going to be adjusting your friends in Discord. I, like I said, I usually leave this about the same as myself, and then my game audio is here. So this is the audio you can see. If I move my, my thing around, you might hear that, but it's, it's adjusting that. So yeah, I usually have that a little lower, but you can obviously edit all of that in post because they're in three separate files. Uh, so yeah, when you drag those three files that I showed you earlier, you're going to drag them into Vegas or After Effects or whatever. They will be the exact same length, so you just start them at the same time, end them at the same time. Um, and you will have your stuff all synced up. So yeah, I hope this improves some of your guys' highlights videos or whatever videos you plan on making with this. But yeah, uh, that's about it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comments below or shoot me a message on Twitter and I will be sure to help you out the best of my abilities. Uh, but yeah, thanks. Peace out, guys.